That's what we are. How to get out of the friend zone? Oh, Can yeah. you get out of the friend zone? That's the question. What do you do on Twitch? Send nudes. What's the beaver tattoo? Think tattoos can make like a 5 out of 10, 7 out of 10. What's going on guys? It's Dr. Hobbs and today I have a very very special video, okay? It's me, the main attraction. Welcome back, Jeff. Hey, 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 you might remember David, me David. from Turks and Caicos. Alright guys, so I have two very special people, alright? I have Sarah, aka Big Mama, and J Money Out. You might remember me from Guy and Jeff if you're an original fan. Okay, no, no, no. Thank no. you for showing up again. <laughs> alright guys, so as you can see we have a hundred chicken nuggets right there in front of us, alright? Pause the video right here and count how many nuggets you can see. Maybe it could be more than 100, but it's not less than 100, I can tell you that, okay? The lady at the cashier at Wendy's was crazy out of that order and it took forever for me to get this. But we're gonna do a mukbang today. Do you know what's a mukbang? I uh, have no idea. Okay, so you know what's a mukbang? All right. Yeah. Okay, let me explain what actually the mukbang is, okay? David calls it mukbang. I don't know if it's mukbang or mukbang. Usually, when people are like sitting and eating food, they want someone to entertain them, to eat, not to feel alone. You know, when you eat food at your office. I always office. feel alone. That's what right. makes me feel too, much better. Yeah. All right, so now you watch this video or any mukbang on YouTube and then you don't feel alone. You're talking to your I'm fans, the people that are watching. We're <laughs> gonna do a mukbang and a little bit of ASMR. David is H at ASMR. I have the ASMR mic right here. You're like the yeah. And then you whisper it. Alright, so we're gonna start eating a hundred nuggets, guys. From Wendy's. Shout out Wendy's. It's not a sponsored video. Please sponsor me. I just got honey mustard because you told me you want honey Whoa, mustard. Well, I didn't mean like honey mustard. I love honey mustard. Oh, that's my favorite. Sarah is a Twitch yes, streamer, sir. right? Do you play Fortnite on Twitch? No, I don't play any games. I'm a girl. <laughs> There's, do you know Pokemon and uh, Valkyrie? They're all big names on Twitch. They play Fortnite. I've heard of them, yeah. I only do IRL, or I guess it's just chilling now. Do you know what's IRL? In real life, I didn't know that. <laughs> Alright, and the thing is, we need to finish the whole 100 nuggets. Might not be possible. But it will be possible. Doable. First of all, you guys may be wondering, is Sarah and Jeff dating because of this picture right here? <laughs> I don't know. I actually don't know. Are you guys dating or not? That's a great question, man. We're actually not. We're, uh... No. We are brother and sister. Uh -huh. Brother and sister? Yeah, uh, very distantly related. Yeah. But so uh, we are working on the. Uh, so you guys are not dating. To no. confirm, yes, no. No, we, yeah. No. So you are dating. No, we are not dating. All right. All no, friends with benefits. Nothing about that. No. I'm a siblings virgin. With, yeah, me too. From no siblings with benefits. I don't believe in that. Okay. Also, thank you, Red Bull. If you guys didn't see, I did the longest, most tallest Red Bull building with Red Bull cans. Have you watched that? Uh, yeah. Sarah, since you're the only girl here. Mm -hmm. right. I want to ask you some, like, people want to know advice about stuff, okay? Yeah. Yeah, me too. Okay, Jeff too and me as well, right? So, now to talk to a girl, get to know a girl, we'll hear a social media. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Slip in the DMs. Yes. Yeah. What would you think is the best way for a guy to slide into a girl's DMs? Be good looking. Be, <laughs> be good at So, doesn't matter what we say. <laughs> So you can say anything? Mm -hmm. Because my thing is that obviously I'm not very attractive, so what I use <laughs> is a series of jokes. Those those don't work if I have monthly. So whatever you can say anything to go just need to be good looking? Yeah, that's how, what I think. How do you know if you're good looking? Yeah, what's good ask looking you, for you? Ask, just ask someone. <laughs> Am I? Are you good looking? <laughs> it's the Jeff, answer. You're, you're my brother. Oh my god. Yeah, it's fine. Your brother can be good looking too. Like. She said no, basically. <laughs> Alright, how do you start in the DMs? I know you do a lot. Um, I've never actually sent one, but if I were to... <laughs> okay, don't lie. You know <laughs> what I would do is... Um, you know what? There's a number of strategies. So, one of them is obviously replying to their story. That's an easy one. Oh, you do that all the time. Um, don't believe that, please. Um, <laughs> I've done that occasionally. Um, uh -huh. another way, you send a picture of a man. Oh, no, you, th you taught me that one. He's a man completely, completely stripped down of hair, and he what? is diving into a pool oh, of water. Yeah. Wait, how do you know it doesn't have hair? Well, I've examined the picture quite a bit, mm -hmm. as I've used it mm -hmm. once or twice, as I said. It worked, no? Uh, yeah, it's highly successful. So send a picture of a man diving. Go. 
They dive, I say, oh, diving your DMs, ha ha ha. And they say, oh, that's so charming and funny. That's cute. That's cute. What the f did ever, like, reply to that? Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, not a lot. They, re they reply, they laugh, and they tend to get an unfollow after. <laughs> <laughs> so that's, uh, I wanna take notes. How would you slide into someone's DM? I usually really, really don't. I What I do is I send a picture of something, like, rest there, I met Chip, and. Like on Snapchat? Mm mm. I'm you DM. send people Instagram like pictures. Not people, alright. It's not a many, many people. I, I did it once. I actually no, just did it once. Once. Let's check your DM. <laughs> no, I actually literally just did it once. I sent a picture. I was at a nice location. I sent a picture of that location. I was at a cottage in the mountains. You That's sent them <laughs> like your location or like a picture of the mountains. Okay. No, I sent them a picture of the view, the mountain. Oh. Like, oh. And then it worked. This that be us, but you playing. Okay, Sarah. Mm -hmm. How can a guy know that he's in the friend zone? Right? Can Very you? good question. I'm actually quite curious. <laughs> yeah. I just found out I was her brother. I feel See, like Jeff would be the today. best person to answer <laughs> this. Okay, Jeff, how do you know that you're in the friend zone? Um, for me, most girls tell me <laughs> they're not interested in <laughs> seeing me any further. They don't think about me romantically. And they so do you guys hook up first? No, no, we oh. do not. No, we do not hook up. There's no problem. <laughs> um, um, talk to them and say hello. I'm very polite, and complete and total gentleman. And I think that's my issue. Complete gentleman, and then they told me, you know what? You're too nice, Jeff. It's about time. I don't think I've seen this about, side of you. <laughs> it's about time we, I make you my friend and just my friend. <laughs> okay, Sarah. Is there any way out, Sarah? That's what. About, how to get out of the friend zone? How Can you get out of the friend zone? That's the question. No. <laughs> no. So once you're in your friend zone, there's no way you can come out of it. That rules out half the population Actually, maybe. of Ottawa. Oh. Go on. You, like, I feel like the, the way to get out of the friend zone is like, by making the other person physically attracted to you. So you just have to like, so force just rip it, it out? Them. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. You, uh, say that again, say it right. That's, that's... <laughs> Can we back that, that up? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> can we rewind there? Just what did you just say? Say that again. Go on. Like you have to say the words you said. Force it on. Oh my! God. How do you force it on? What do you mean by force it on? Like I'm scared. I don't know. Just start kissing someone. <laughs> do you think there are any laws that would maybe say that's not okay? <laughs> I mean. Okay, so right now, if Jeff starts kissing it, you, that's is it that. Worth it? I don't know. No, probably not. I don't think so. Okay, so if Jeff starts kissing you right now, you guys said, like, he's in the friend zone. Obviously, he's not her brother, not related, because look at that. Yeah. But <laughs> if if you start kissing her, not like just hypothetically speaking, that, that means he's out of the friend zone? Well, probably. Ready? There you go. Yeah, Those are tips. Uh, <laughs> you find love and on the Dr. Hobbs channel. I just this found some people. Should we leave? Yeah. <laughs> no, you, you, do you want me to leave? Like, yeah, we can just stay here. Yeah, yeah, no. I want it filmed anyways. You want it filmed? That's what I said. Don't really try, try that, guys. Don't really yeah, go kissing people. Don't do any of that. No, none of that. Don't go kissing people because if you're in the friend zone, you're probably going to stay in the friend zone. Just move on. Life goes on. You got to find another mm -hmm. one, okay? But in this case, I don't know what's going on. There might be a chance. Are we moving on with the nuggets? I have had a lot. Can we get a count? I should have been counting. I hate myself. Okay, guys. Now I feel like it's time to do some ASMR, okay? My favorite. I just, you don't know what it is. Jeff just learned what it was today. Well, I've never done ASMR before. I did some on some videos, but it's not really actually ASMR. So right now, okay, right now at this moment, turn your volume up the most you can, all right? Right now. Yo, Blake, my dog's outside. <laughs> okay, let me tell you a bit about my dog because you guys keep hearing about him and he can't eat some food and stuff, but... He's scary. My dog is scary, all right? He's, he looks like a big white teddy bear, but he's actually scary. He's not used to people and he stresses about a lot about people. So if any of you guys know what I can do so my dog could be more calm around people, he's, just, he's used to the people he knows. Like, he's very used to David because he sees David a lot. But since he's never seen them, like he's seen Jeff, okay, he's seen you, but like a while ago. But since he I never seen him, since he never seen you Sarah, him? Oh. yeah, he was the first one who seen him. <laughs> but it's been a while; they haven't come over. Oh. 
So if you guys know what I can do for my dog and like like people again, I don't train know. Him. He he went to so many training schools they can't train him. Yeah, They're scared of him. He's untrainable. He's too big. No, I don't know what to do. He did canine training school, no? He did. I feel like you just need to make him more socialized. But how? Like always bring him around people. He'll I'm bite people. Scared. I'm scared. He'll bite you. We'll put a little what a muzzle. I have a muzzle one, but he's gonna he's keep a, going. He's the strongest jaw in the world. His breed is a Japanese Akira. If you guys are wondering, okay? All right, Sarah. Start uh, getting to Twitch, sir. Why? Why? Because yeah. I wanted to make money. Wow. So you make money off Twitch? You so what do you do exactly? Send nudes. Okay, never mind. What do you do? <laughs> <laughs> Please subscribe. <laughs> what do you do on Twitch? Send nudes. You send nudes to people? No. If you ask. If they ask. She will. No. I like don't. if Jeff goes on Twitch, guys. goes to your Twitch account and says, "Hey, send I'll me some nudes." I'll give you nudes. ten dollars for. Seriously? So someone sends you money to for you to send them a nude? No, I don't actually do that, guys. So. Oh. Oh. <laughs> so I should. Jump to send me money. Should I unsubscribe then? Mm -hmm. That's what it was. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> wow. So people pay you to get your Snapchat. So if I. Well, actually, to... no. I do. My Snapchat is subs only. So if someone subscribes, they get my Snapchat. Ah. So you accept them or not? Yeah, like anyone can see like my stories. Okay. But if you want to send me a picture of something, oh like you're my goodness. Okay. No, it's fine. I'll leave that. <laughs> <laughs> Jeff is an account. If anyone is wondering, I'll do your taxes and I'll do YouTube you do part mine? time. But for the easy. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Sarah is a. She's actually a bartender and yes, a I am. Twitch, Twitch streamer. streamer. So I'm a okay. Cool girl. <laughs> Wow, that was the least cool thing I've ever heard in my life. And I'm an At least I'm not an accountant. Yeah, well, okay, eat, eat. I'm a cool girl. Yeah. <laughs> okay, Jeff, do you like girls with tattoos? They're my favorite, absolute favorites. I, if, Can you show them your tattoos? Do you guys want to see my t all of them? Every or just my arm? How many tattoos do you have? And where? Like, over 20. Really? Yeah. How many are on your arm? Well, I would count this as three. Because it was three different ones. So there's 17 hidden tattoos. Where? Okay, let's try to guess there's let's that. Play a game. Oh, guess for Sarah's tattoo. Okay, so what about your other point? Oh, well, I have some. like I have some like these are all. Are oh, those dots considered tattoos? Yeah. Oh, okay. Those are all tattoos. Accountants aren't allowed to get tattoos. Actually? No, not actually. But <laughs> okay. We're not cool enough to get tattoos. So no. And I have zero tattoos. I'm yet to do my first tattoo. I don't really like tattoos to on me. I like how, I like seeing that on people, but on me I don't really like it. Specifically, women. I don't mind on guys too. Like it's it's no. just a beer tattoo. I think tattoos can make like a five out of ten, like a seven out of ten. A two point bump. So right, those that's are what notes. I mean. That's what right I mean. down. Yeah, Put down, do a tattoo. So Sarah, you tattoo mm -hmm. to get to a three. You would say, <laughs> I get a two point bump. <laughs> so you'll go from a one to, <laughs> three. to three. Correct. That's what it's perfect. Yeah, no, I actually, like Justin Bieber's tattoo, that's a sick ass tattoo. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it, it depends on the person. Like, I think some people. Well, some people go. it looks really trashy on. It's really bad. You know what? Drake actually has terrible tattoos. Oh, yeah, Drake I see those tattoos. tattoos. Yeah, the um, random Drake, tattoos. Yeah, his are so bad. Right? That's my second Red Bull. Okay, guys, I have an actual serious addiction to Red Bulls. I don't know, I can't stop drinking them. That's my second one. I drink literally two a day. That's if not. If you saw his basement, you'd be terrified. My body feels weird, man. I've had a lot of these. I'm saying, <laughs> I feel weird. Okay, guys, we're actually very full. If you rewind the video from the very beginning, you've seen how much we eat. We ate, ate and eaten. I can't. Maybe move. they can tell us how many we've eaten. Yeah, yeah. Please, count. Someone count for us. Please, someone start counting how many someone... each one ate. All right. I, I feel think like I ate I... the most. No, I feel I... like I ate no, the most. I I for sure. To be honest, to be honest, I put the most for Sarah and but... the least for for us. But. Uh... <laughs> Okay, well maybe I lied then, but I'm trying my best. Oh, I was gonna ask Sarah about that. Would you like, like, if a guy is not fit and doesn't go to the gym a lot, like me? Wait, yeah, no, and me. Like yeah. Me. I don't, not I don't like really me. go to the gym, but would girls like guys that are ripped and like have abs and packs and all that stuff, or it doesn't really matter? It's just like the. For me, my role is as, as long as they're bigger than me, but not too big. Like. Okay. So am I? Okay, okay, you're yourself. <laughs> Let's go here. <laughs> <laughs> Holy <laughs> okay, that, that's like, fast. I would prefer someone who went to the gym. 
because then that can be like something we can do together but like that's cute yeah what would your first date be like your dream first date what would it be a gym <laughs> first date <gym. laughs> that's what i do um eat i'm trying come on <laughs> I don't really know. Probably just going to eat. So this is your ideal first date right now. As I'm, I'm Yo, bro! <laughs> you got after this video is done, you guys can have your own business outside. This is trying. <laughs> My ideal first date would be eating a hundred chicken nuggets. Oh, good enough. In Gear. front of a camera. <laughs> Gear in. That's amazing. All right, Jeff. What would be your first ideal first date? Um, if a girl took me. To you want her to pay? I want her to take <laughs> me to Bali because I deserve it. What the? F that first date that why a queen would not be able to do that. She could if she if I'm <laughs> worth it, which I'll be saying. Okay, my ideal first date, like actually, actually ideal first date, is if the girl makes the plans, like because usually guys do the plans, but if a girl come up and she makes the plan and like she says, okay, babe, tonight we're gonna have this dinner and watch that movie. And then back home. Wow. That would be an amazing day, you know. I love that. That's it. Decisiveness in a woman. Yeah. Very important. Food. She decides it's what a rare, restaurant. Rare Boom. And she decides the movie. <laughs> Boom. That's the keeper. Yeah. You know what? That's I, not I very disagree. much. I know. I don't care about the love. Please. Yeah. For me, you I'm know, easy honestly, if they're not gonna do Bali with me, then I guess I would settle for like a, I like hiking personally. Oh yeah. I would like a nice little hike. We can do. I'm not planning any of this or doing any of it, but have do a nice virgin. I don't believe in any of that. So I, I think I'd do a hike with like a picnic would be really nice for me. That we go back, yeah. back. That's actually good. Like it's adventure because you have this adventure sense in you. I think so, and you know it makes it memorable. I think personally, the hike, yeah, the hike. You know, and it's then way you better. Go than back there in two years and propose to her. Yeah. There you go, exactly. Now you're thinking, years or guys, that's the first or thing Sarah says months. that is not sexual. <laughs> right that Let's down. go to tracker on that. <laughs> yeah. A counter. It's better than the stuff I usually say. That's so, so goodness. Oh. I don't know. <laughs> Speaking of which, so how many years of dating is enough to then get married? I feel like you just know. True, just that's true. Yeah, yeah. Like if so you can no see minimum. yourself like having a family with that person. But like you can also tell at the beginning. Like I've dated people where I like. How long was I mean, your longest like, relationship? Uh, like a year and a couple months. I think. A year? That's that's not bad. What about you? Two years? <laughs> Six months. Uh, maybe like eight months. Oh. What about There's you? Some Me, I uh, stayed with someone for two years, I think. What's the most important thing in a relationship to you? For me, to me, for me, okay, whatever. You guys know my English is not the best English, but anyway, I'm not good with words, so I'm not gonna try to be clever and say clever words. But anyways. <laughs> In a relationship, I feel like trust is the most important thing. And uh, communication. Yeah, we're talking about me right now, but Sorry. trust <laughs> is the most important thing. Communication. See, he said what he meant. <laughs> <laughs> He's honest. Yeah. Lots of communication here. Yeah. Uh, no, actually, like to be honest, I just like trust. Trust is the base of everything. That's what I feel. And okay, I and mean, you just develop trust over time. It's not like a. You develop. Some after, people. Like, like for me, I Are start. Are you a naturally trusting person? Yeah, I trust someone right away until they do something and prove it wrong. That's that's mm -hmm. how I, I move. Mm -hmm. But yeah, what about you, Sarah? What's the most important thing? Communication. For me, I think loyalty is very important. So trust. Trust. That's one thing he knows similar. a lot about. Loyalty. I'm very loyal. I'm like a oh, dog. Yeah. <laughs> you are a dog. <laughs> <laughs> but no, seriously, I think uh, loyalty is important and truthfulness. Same thing as you. It's like uh, it's the base. But I'm not. I'm not naturally as trusting. I'd say. But excuse me. I'm sorry. I'm actually gonna <laughs> explode. But <laughs> <laughs> we're about to finish a hundred chicken nugget. That's actually crazy. <laughs> we still have six more nuggets to go. Actually, guys, we're dying. I can barely move. All right. Let's let's yo, eat one. Eat one. Stop. I've been eating. Okay guys, so that's actually the first mukbang I ever do on my channel, okay? With these two nice people, Jeff and Sarah. But guys, if you want to see more mukbang, smash that thumbs up, comment down below, and let me know if you want to see Jeff and Sarah again. Yes, you do. Yes, you do. It's, 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 okay, <laughs> honestly, probably not. But listen, I'm trying my best here. I'm doing my best. Uh, I'm going to keep Alright, me alone with Sarah and Jeff is a bit too much. I, there's a lot of <laughs> stuff, a lot of energy and tension, so I'm, I'm feeling a bit uncomfortable, to be honest. I'm not. 
But are we gonna finish these or no? Yeah. Well, are we, we have going to finish these or? I are have, we? Okay, how many are left? Six. Six. What's six divided by? Two. Two, Two each. each. <laughs> I, I actually yeah, do. Yeah. That. <laughs> if you have to delete one social media, is it Instagram or Snapchat? I would delete Snapchat. And you would keep Instagram? I could keep Instagram easily. What about Sarah? I feel like she'd keep Snapchat because she's making money from Snapchat. No, I'm too self-absorbed and I like to post pictures of myself, so yeah, definitely Snapchat. Same. And so I you would delete Snapchat and you keep Instagram? I would delete Snapchat. And for me, like Instagram allows me to be someone I'm not. Yeah. And I can post <laughs> pictures that women believe, sorry, people believe. This is one picture of Jeff and Sarah. <laughs> <laughs> I look better than I actually do. Uh, it's not really a catfish. I, I just use angles well. I think. Personally, that, that Photoshop, actually, you know, make it <laughs> a little bit bigger. Never use. <laughs> I actually like if you had your hair color like that, and I'm wondering. Do you see? Look at this right now. It's actually bad. It's really not good. Yeah. What's wrong with it? What's right about it? Look. It's actually all over the place. Well, it's because you have a hat on. Well, it's more the color, I think. Yeah, the color is it's going black and black. black. Some of it's blonde. Well, that's what happens when your hair grows. All right, well, I'm a brunette, actually. And I'm thinking to dye my hair another color. I don't know. I noticed. I noticed. I don't want to show. Anyways, um, guys, I'm trying to dye my hair another color. It's blonde right now, as you guys know. But I don't know what next color. I don't want to do crazy stuff. I'm not going purple or blue like David. You should do. Um, I'm thinking to do gray. Platinum. Yeah. Pla gray. Platinum. Platinum. It's like the same thing. Platinum gray. Yeah. Platinum blonde. Do it. Kind of the same it looks thing, good. But I would do it too. Did you go through all the sauces? How many sauces did you swallow? No, but look, he leaves one, like two. half the sauce. No, I don't. No, I do not. Look at this one, no. Jeff. Yeah, you it's actually leave okay, this the one. Okay, a wrapper it. got in there somehow. Look at this is using it. Okay, how many sauces Please. did each man's went through? How many? Okay, we'll say one, two, this three, is three, four, five. Five sauces? One, two, six, three, four, kind of. five, six with my seventh on the way. I went to one. Because <laughs> he bro. doesn't eat any. Yeah, he I am. I barely, I barely put some sauce by it. Because uh, sauce. Makes it bigger. It makes yeah, it makes you fuller. And I drank two Red Bulls. Okay, they got, it's, it's, it's hard, hard to eat. It's hard to eat, man. <laughs> no, okay, Blaze. I'll, I'll take one for the team. Okay. Now you next. You're <laughs> your <laughs> Just put a new two. Three. You guys cheer to it. Okay. No, I should eat it for an, a new relationship made on the Doctor Hobbs channel. Three, two, I one. I love my brother. Uh, we finished a hundred pieces of nuggets. All right, okay, wow. It's the hardest thing I've ever done. It's actually super yeah, hard. Yeah, it's way hard harder work. than it no, looks. No, my life is very hard. I count it. <laughs> and that, guys, I want you to tell us who ate the most, Dr. Hobbs, Jeff, or Sarah. Let me know down in the comments. And for now, I hope you guys enjoyed that mukbang. If you want to see more mukbangs or ASMR, I know or this- Jeff. I know this ASMR was a bit awkward because Jeff, uh, there's a lot of tension Jack over here. Jeff kept on laughing. I could have done it. I'm new to it. it. So I don't know. Next time, probably going to get someone other than Jeff with okay. Sarah, but then Jeff is jealous. So I don't know what to do. But anyways. <laughs> oh, that's, I knew that's what happened. Yes. It was jealousy. Hope you enjoyed that video. I will see you in the next one. I'm out. You know how to do my, my outro? Obvious. <laughs> oh, <my God. laughs> what is it called? Peace. Obvious. <laughs>